The Scottish journalist Kevin McKenna wrote a series of bizarre lies about me this weekend in his Sunday Herald column. He alleged that I was spreading conspiracy theories about MI5. So how did this happen? Well, as with so much disinformation, it all began with this dreadful rag, the Daily Express. Rubbish paper publishes lots of nonsense, mostly about Meghan Markle. And they ran an article saying that an SNP MP was spreading conspiracy stories about MI5. And they used a picture of me to illustrate the non-story. Inevitably, that was picked up by the usual suspects, including the Scottish Tories. And then it was tweeted and retweeted in the usual way. All lies. Many of the Tories deleted when I threatened them with a bit of legal action. So I thought the story had run its course, but then along bumbled Kevin McKenna of the Herald on Sunday. He picked up all the nonsense from the Express. He embellished it with a really nasty tone. It was defamatory. So I complained to the Herald and I've had the Herald editor on the phone. She has apologized without reservation for what Kevin McKenna said. And we're now talking about where the apology should appear and how much money they should give to charities of my choice. I want newspapers to survive and flourish. I'm a journalist myself. So although this was defamation, although I could get a lot of money for it, that's not really my motivation. I just want to drive up standards because I don't think any of us want politics to be in the gutter and the press to be in the gutter. I'll keep you posted.